All right. Good morning, kindergarten. I'm going to share with you a special activity we're going to do today. And so I'm going to go, you can see I have lots of flip grids. I'm going to go into Mrs. Duckin's um, East and Consolidated group, and you just will need to go into Mrs. Duncan's group, whatever that group is going to be. And then the right-hand corner here, it says View 10 Topics. You're going to click on to it. And you're going to look for the snow globe activity right here, okay? And that's what we're going to do, the snow globe family activity, actually. So when I click on to it, it's going to tell me um, some directions. And if I want the directions read to me, I'm going to go to the immersive reader, the blue icon here. I'm going to click on to it, and then it's going to open it up for me. So I can have it read to me. And in order to do that, I'm going to use this green button right down here to do that. And once I'm done, the words are going to play where I can see them and I can follow along. Once I'm done listening to the directions, then I can go to the upper left hand corner here and go to that arrow and click on it and it will bring me back to the page. So the very first thing I want you to do is listen to the Snow Globe Family book. I love, love, love this book. And my kindergartners last year in library loved this book. After you're done with this book, then I want you to watch this video I made of myself inside a snow globe because guess what? You're going to be inside a snow globe today. How exciting is that? Yay! That is like super duper exciting. All right. And what we're going to do is we're going to make a snow globe video with all of our virtual kindergartners. So I need to show you how to put yourself into a snow globe. And I need you to record yourself into Flipgrid. But we have to make sure the background noise is pretty quiet because then I'm going to add some music to it, all right? And I'm going to show you what we're going to do. And don't forget, I have it inside here too. But when you make the video, you have to be pretty quiet. So you have to do it somewhere where it's pretty quiet. So we're going to get started. All right, so I'm going to click on to it. Now remember I said effects is where we want to go. So this is a new feature, it's called effects, that you may not have ever used before, and that's what we're going to use to do this cool activity. And we want to go to GIFs right here. Some say GIFs, others say GIFs. We're going to click onto it. And then in the search bu button here, we're going to click Snow Globe. And we have a couple options. We have GIFs we can use, and we also have stickers. So I'm going to type in Snow Globe. And I want to hit the blue search button. I'm going to click onto it. And then I can see some snow globes. Now remember in the video, Mrs. Norning has, she's inside. And so some of these snow globes are, would cover my face. And I don't want the faces to be covered. So um, I felt like in stickers was the better place to go. And so in stickers... I can look for a snow globe. Now remember, I want them so that um, I can, I'm visible inside them. Let's see if this one, am I visible? Nope. See, I'm not visible in that one. So if I stretched it out, it would cover me. So I don't want that one. And if I pick something I don't want, I'm going to hit the trash button. And then I'm going to go back to effects to try again. All right. Now, if you want to add some snowflakes into it, sure, go ahead. And you can put some snow flakes around to fill it in for later. Um, and then you can go back and just add a couple of them if you want. Like Mrs. Norton is doing, I'm just adding a couple snowflakes. And notice I keep going back to my effects. And I am still in stickers here. So I want to find a snow globe that I can be present in. Oh, this one with the tree, I can be present. Let's see this one. I can see myself, um, but I would be covered up. So that one might not be a good one either. It's close, but not close enough. So again, I'm going to go into my effects, and I'm going to look for a snow globe that is going to work for me. That is clear. And it was pretty easy for Mrs. Norning to find it the first time. Oh, look at, there's this one here. If you find one that's a little different, that's okay because that would make things interesting. So this is a new one that I didn't see before. And you know what? Will this one work? I think it will. And we can just move the snowflakes and we just want to shrink them with our two fingers to make them smaller. So we can use this snow globe too. 
all right? And then as long as you put yourself into it, and remember, you're going to shiver in that. So I am going to stand up and I'm going to either shiver and I've got the snow falling or I'm going to look up into the sky. Remember all those different options and I want to be quiet when I'm in here so that when I take your video, I can put it into a big long video and we can see all our snow globe family of virtual learners in this video I'm so excited to create for you. So once you're done, you only need just a little time recording this. You're going to go and you're going to click the, let me see if I can find it. You're going to click the play button so that it's ready to play, okay? So I'm going to click it and I think you guys know the rest of this, but let me just get started. So And then you're going to hit the pause button. And you know what to do next. You're going to go over here to the green check mark. And once you think it's A-OK, okay, you're going to hit the green check mark. And then you're going to submit your response. Okay? And you can return to the topic. And you will see your recording. That's it. I can't wait to see all your cool videos. Enjoy this activity.